Kevin, I gotta ask you off the bat. Growing up, who were some of your favorite baseball players? Uh, Roy Halladay was kind of my all-time favorite. Uh, Josh Beckett, uh, Randy Johnson. I wanted to be the right-handed version of Randy Johnson, um, but you know, obviously not nearly as tall as him, and um, don't throw it nearly as hard as him. But you know, he was a guy that I watched a lot of, and uh, was just an animal out there. I loved his demeanor. Um, Kurt Schilling, you know, really just any stud pitcher from the. The early late 90s. I love it. I love it. So I do this course called Baseball Mount Rushmore. Okay. Now I put you on the spot. I know, but I'm gonna have you do your Baseball Mount Rushmore of pitchers. Your four. So okay. who is your four? We got Roy Halladay. Okay. Probably front and center. I'm gonna go. I'm gonna go Jim Johnson, closer. Okay. Um, just got played with him. Awesome guy. Great closer. Um, super sink. Fastball. Jeez, um, then I'm gonna go Mariano. Um, obviously, like cutter legend, unbelievable career. Uh, man, that's a stud list already. Uh, yeah. I'm gonna go Josh Beckett. I was a huge Josh Beckett fan, okay. so I loved watching him. And when he was young, he really just let it let it fly. I love that. So I know you said you don't play video games, but when you saw yourself on a video game for the first time, obviously MLB the show. What did you think about that? I thought it was crazy. Um, you know, it's a surreal moment anytime, you know, first time of year. They show up in spring training and they do like a, a full body comp thing on you. And, um, you know, I just remember asking, like, what is this for? Like, oh, this is for the video game. I was like, man, this is crazy. I never thought I would ever be in a video game. So, you know, definitely a pinch me moment. Um, super cool. But, you know, I get a lot of kids in my neighborhood back home that always tag me in like games that they pitched with me. And, um, you know, they make me throw like 175 pitches in nine innings, just wear me out. And so, um, luckily, that's not the, the case in real life. I love that. I love that. So, you talked about the Mount Rushmore baseball, different things, and you faced a lot of different guys, but I got to ask you about one player. So, we talk about video games and we say creative players, guys that can do both, but there's only one guy in baseball, Shoy Otani. For you as a pitcher, being a great pitcher, but seeing a guy that can pitch and also hit 40 home runs, what do you think about that? Uh, I mean, it's unbelievable. I mean, that's why everybody's talking about him all the time. It's, it's something we've never seen before. Um, and when we did, it was a long time ago, and it didn't even compare to what we're seeing now. Um, you know, it's a guy who throws 100 miles an hour and can hit a ball 500 feet. I mean, there's not many guys in the world that can do that, let alone at the major league level. And so, um, you know, there's nobody. It's just him. And so, um, really cool to watch him. Um, you know, just change the game, and hopefully, you know, it inspires the next generation to, to not just be pitchers, you know, to not um, just be a pitcher in middle school, you know, that's what some of these kids are, are becoming, um, so just one position, you know, based, and so you know, hopefully Shohei is kind of the, the inspiration for a lot of kids to, to stick with doing both or playing multiple sports, you know, maybe we'll see another Bo Jackson at some point or something like that, I mean, that would be... That would be the ultimate uh, exciting thing to see as, a, as an athlete and as a fan of, of, of both sports and just sports in general. All right, I love it. A few more questions. So, you know, with the pitchers now, especially the closers, everybody has theme walk-up songs and music. Um, but I got to ask you, Kevin Gossman, the song. You can pick any artist to have your song when you walk up to the mound. Oh, man. Who would you want to do your song? Oh, man. <laughs> um, and it's named after you, by the way. If I could pick anybody... Could I like go back in time? Yeah, that a lot. Okay, I'm I'm going Pink Floyd. Ooh. Yeah, I'm going Pink Floyd. Um, I just think they would come up with some crazy song. You know? I like that. Awesome. I like that. So, favorite baseball movie of all time, and that's the finale's new question of the day. I'm gonna go uh, for the love of the game. You Ooh. know, pitcher throws a perfect game, I believe, or a no hitter, and so uh, just kind of follows him throughout his whole career, and um, it's kind of a love lovey movie too and so uh you know if you got a wife or a significant other definitely a good movie to watch all right last question so obviously coming from the giants you come to this blue jay scene and i mean obviously the names vlad bo just george you know they add you with jose and alec 
Can you talk about what you see in the potential of this team? Because, I mean, obviously that was a big move for you to go to Canada and play for the Blue Jays. How do you feel about this team going forward? Yeah, I think there's a lot of excitement right now in Toronto. Obviously, um, the talent that we have on this team is, you know, not really uh, comparable on most nights, uh, to be honest. You know, a very talented team, a lot, of, a lot of youth, too. A lot of these guys are 24 years old, which a lot of guys forget, and they're three years in the big leagues already, too. And so, um, you know, it's great to see Manoa succeed. Obviously, a, a young starting pitcher in the big leagues at his age, having this season that he's having, um, doesn't come around very often. So, you know, obviously, we're hoping for that for the rest of his career from him. That would be amazing. And so, um, it, it's a, a good group and a good mix of, of veteran guys, but also youth that keeps it loose. And so, you know, but we got George and also some other guys who have been in those World Series scenarios. And so, we definitely lean on them for uh, postseason experience. Well, uh, Kevin, man, keep doing your thing out there. Appreciate the time, man, and look forward to seeing you in that World Series, man. I think you can have it. All right, man. Appreciate, appreciate it. Appreciate it. Thank you. Man. Thank you. Yeah,